Back at it. All right, round 50. <laughs> nah, not really. But we have been here a while. <laughs> All right. Make some more rings. Ooh, where's my... Missing one of my tools. One more. most important skill to have in chain mail. Or wire art in general. And last one. Camera adjustment. All right, let's put it together. <laughs> 20 rings to go, I believe. Or, I'm sorry, 20 stars to go. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, and 12. Get those out of the way. Bad camera angle today. And yeah, it's a little better. Almost time to start working on the stripes. Last one. Bum, 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 bum. I wouldn't go that far. 
filling out the same numbers over and over again. Pattern, just like any kind of stitch work. Mess that one up. It is indeed. It is a good time saver, but a lot of people don't like it because it does hurt your finger. I, however, have been using mine for over a decade, so I'm used to it. Now, if you're making something with aluminum, or aluminium, then you're probably fine, but. Steel crafts, yeah, your finger's gonna hurt. Alright, six little ones. Of course, gotta make those two. So, I'll show you in just a second here. Crimp this last little bit. Alright, so the reason it makes your finger hurt. You got your little ring here and you're going to use your other ring. And you stick it in there, and when you twist it, you're twisting the ring like that on your finger. The tougher the material, the more it's going to hurt. Obviously, you do it once or twice, it's not going to bother you, but if you're a chain mailer and you're sitting here doing this hundreds and hundreds of times, yeah, your hand's going to get sore. you got to switch up your fingers. Good old Brandon... Yeah, I never finished, Brandon. He's still sitting there, headless. Hello, DW July. That was our last appearance of Brandon. <laughs> After we chopped off his head. Bob is a lot further along than the last time he's made an appearance, but we can't really tell because... <laughs> The detail work has just been to reinforce him, so he doesn't look all that different, but hundreds of paper clips have been added. Oh, can't complain. Well, I mean, I can't complain. It just doesn't do any good. Can always complain. Thank you for the roses, Crystal. Thank you for the follow, Raymond Ruiz 06 and Gothic 83. Oh, that's a tough one. Trying to run away from me, ring. Sometimes you gotta get the double pliers. Got it. That's right, American flag out of paper clips. Thank you for the ice cream cone and the weights. Crystal. Crystalese. And the GG. I don't think I've gotten a GG before. And the present, and the tennis, and the ape. <laughs> Just throw, throw in the kitchen sink in there somewhere. There. That star is ready to be attached. Dun, 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 dun. Six 
one more left on this row, so we might as well add it here. Yep, all the circles are cut from paper clips. Start to finish, everything by hand. One paper clip at a time. Welcome back, Callum. Or Callum. Callum. One of those options, I hope. Thank you for the follow. 420 Cool Guy 69. I need some more little rings. Well, so far, you can see the whole thing right there. That's as far as we've gotten. Which might not seem like much, but that is many, 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 many hours of work to get this far. I have not gotten any further on the paperclip display. I still need to. Bob and this American flag have taken all my time. Needy bastards. We'll do short projects after I finally finish this one. Of course, this was supposed to be like a medium project, and it's turned into a big project. Uh, not very often. I mean, it's a pattern. Once you get the pattern, maybe when you first start, you do a bunch of accidents. Every now and then you'll see me make an accident, but I'll catch it pretty fast. Calm down, Brandon. <laughs> That's all you're getting. All of this, just to attach one star. Stars don't take long to make, but attaching them together takes forever. Forever. Make sure I'm ready to go before I attach this. Okay. And make sure we get the star facing the right direction. That would be a... Important thing to do. Do, 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 do. Miss that cook. Temp number two. I think we got it. Yep. Right. First hook is always the worst. Of course I remember your therapist. Still a weird one. Yep, everything is made out of paper clips. Powder coated paper clips. I hate this one. This one's always a pain in the ass to connect. Two. Come on. Just cooperate. 
All right, I'm going to have to connect it, then spin it around, then unconnect it, and then reconnect it. Good times. Okay, one more connection to make there. Don't drop it. Got it. Okay, that one little point is connected. <laughs> I'm gonna need some more rings. So I gotta do all the stripes and I still have to do the king's mail around the outer edge so that it works with the stripes. A lot more blue. I'm running low. I'm gonna need to powder coat some more. I need more blue and more white. Practice. Once you get the basics down, you can do a lot. This is actually my first project doing this pattern. It won't be my last. I think I'm only going to do one more project with this, though. I did not realize how labor-intensive this was going to be when I first started this pattern, but it's the only one I could find that looked somewhat like stars. So I do what I got to do. What you think about Will Smith slapping the S out of Chris Rock? I think it was a mistake, and it sets a precedent. Because there's a lot of comics who insult people. And if we start saying that that one was okay, you're going to have a whole bunch of comics getting assaulted left and right across the country. And I get the whole, oh, he was, he made an insult about his wife who has a health condition. Well, I'm bald. That's a health condition. People make fun of me, too. I don't go around slapping them. But now nah, you just, you can't set that precedent. I mean, there's very few comedians that don't insult someone. We are making an American flag out of paper clips. It ain't good publicity. I mean, you always got to look at everything on the lens of, if the people were different, would it be a different situation? Let's 
say you had, I don't know, Scarlett Johansson being the one who made the joke, and then she gets slapped. Would it still be the same, same thing? It would be a lot worse. But you just cannot be raising fists at nobody for that shit. I mean, I've had people pull my channel off, accuse me of doing things that later came out to be not true just to get me banned for a few days. I still wouldn't hit them either. I don't think I've used a million. I've definitely used a hundred thousand. Probably three or four hundred thousand, but not a million. A million is a very, very large number. Probably say ten to twenty thousand a year, maybe. Sixteen ish years. Almost got that one star attached. I can get about a thousand of them for twelve to fifteen dollars. Not too too bad. Of course, then I have to powder coat them, which that's time consuming. Got to buy that material. Not that expensive once you have the setup. As always, when we finally finish this, we will count this to figure out how many paper clips are in this project as well. It's not that hard to do. My mother, she stole them. Almost got this one star attached. Well, it's a pattern, so if you know how many is in each little piece of the pattern, you can count one little section and then just multiply by how many you got. So, in this case, we know we have 50 stars, and I know how much is in each star. And then you got to figure out how many rings do you get out of each paper clip of each size, and yada yada. But it's not, it's a lot easier than it sounds. Almost got this star. When I first did this, and I was only doing the bottom row, and I was like, oh, okay, this pattern's not that bad. But then when I realized I had to connect each star all the way around, I realized how horrible this was going to be. But we're past the halfway point at this point. Yes, I, I take regular silver paper clips and then I powder coat them into different colors using a powder coating machine. So I turn the silver ones into the colored ones. Last ring on the star. Yes, the glove is also paper clips. Thread the needle. Gotcha. Two more little ones and that star is attached. Uh, the machine itself will run you about $200 and then you can get a pound of material for about 15 A pound of coloring material will go very far. <laughs> I've got about a dozen colors. Oh, you're also going to need an air compressor. If you don't already have one of those. A couple different air compressor attachments. But compared to some other setups, it's not a fortune. Oh, you're going to need a nice toaster oven because you got to cook it at 400 degrees for 20 to 30 minutes. All together, I think I got my rig and set up in colors and everything for about 400. 
Alright, so that's 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31 stars. 19 more to go. How long has this live been going on? Because that's one star's work. 25 minutes per star, 19 stars to go. <laughs> ah, I hate this pattern. <laughs> oh, lordy. <laughs> Oh, man. That's about, about eight to nine more hours of this pattern. Just for the stars. Definitely going to have to powder coat some more blue before I get to the end of this. I know. I chose to do it. I chose to do them all. Many projects I've started and regretted <laughs> part way in. It'll look good when it's done. But unfortunately, it is going to be smaller than I had originally hoped. There's no way around that. It's just because of the... I have to do the size of the rest of the flag based on the size of the stars. And I didn't really have any other way to make the stars themselves bigger. Unless I use much bigger rings. But then that would have made it too weak. What do I regret the most? I'm going to have to think about that. <sighs> I'm going to have to think about that. Oh, the shirt. Actually, no, there's not much thought in that. The shirt. That piece of shit shirt. Never should have wasted this <laughs> with that shirt. That's like 9,000 rings for nothing. I hate that project. I mean, I got other projects that are bigger, like Bob. You know, Bob's much bigger, but I don't regret Bob. Bob's amazing. Nope. It's more like a vest. It's not a full shirt. I hate it. I'll see it in hell. Nah, this is definitely not my biggest regret. Most of this work I've gotten done on the flag just watching TV. Chilling out, watching TV, and working while I'm watching. Makes time go by a little faster. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Actually, that drop ceiling material I bought last week, there's a video of that. I regret that. Somebody gave me a little tiny bit of that stuff. It's 12-gauge steel wire. And then I found out I could get a whole spool of it for like 10 15 bucks and i was like hmm, that's pretty cheap i wonder i wonder what i can do with that but i was very disappointed on how little actual stuff i was able to make with that and 100 feet did not go far i don't know i am way too old to remember how i first figured it out or how i first discovered it <laughs> Now, paperclip art, now that is just because I was a wire artist, and I got bored one day, and I had paperclips. And 12 again. I definitely got a powder coat more white and blue, though, otherwise I only got that much left for the stars. Gonna be about 15 stars short. That's another couple hours I gotta add on top of that. Unfortunately, the powder coating is also not a fast process. Guess I better get some of those paper clips ready. I'll do one more star, and then I will get 100 paper clips ready for coating. I have not made the Mark VI powder coating rig yet, so I'm still limited to 100 at a time, but still, 100 powder coated clips is pretty good. I haven't found a real great paint stripper yet, though. Either the stuff doesn't strip enough, you want to get all the oils off your from your hands and stuff before you spray, otherwise uh, powder doesn't stick very well, but 
either the stuff I've been using is not strong enough or it's too strong and turns into a gelatinous horror show. Sure, Jordan. Uh, there are a few videos of it. I don't think I got a playlist of it. I'll pin it. I'll pin the, the setup after this video. Dun, 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 dun. Apparently, my phone charger is not charging. Hold on. Where you at, phone plug? Nothing? Okay, it's not the outlet. It's plugged into the same outlet as my light. Back on. Yeah, hold on. Bear with me. All right, we're good. OTS the 29th. I'm so excited. What the hell is the OTS? Yes, when I'm not on live, I do this in silence. I still mumble to myself, though. I am quite a mumbler. Nope, this is a standard chainmail tool called a jump ring opener. Although, not a lot of people use it, but... Anything that allows me to create things. I stitch. I wood craft crap. Not good looking wood crafts, but, you know, they work. <laughs> My wood art is functional, not, <laughs> not visually... <laughs> There's been plenty of errors on that one. Dun, 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 dun. All right, blues. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to powder coat. This is the last of my blues and I am out of white. I am a gamer as well. I have not started Elden Ring. I have started Tiny Tina's Wonderlands, but indecisiveness and ADHD has really caused me problems in that game because I have restarted like, well, six times because there's six possible characters. <laughs> I am doing okay. Hello, Builder Bob. Good old Builder Bob. All right, one more of those. I think that'll be enough to get me through this flower, this uh, star. They do. We take breaks. But I typically do this for at least a few hours a day. Depending on other life. Things that are required. Like walking the dog and cooking. Both of which I still have to do tonight.
We are making an American flag. Slowly. All right. Oh, wait. Might help if I finish the star before I try to attach it. Just a thought. Nope. I give away. I do not sell. The moment I start selling, then it's a job. Can I make your booty next? What? I'm afraid I don't know what the hell that is. <laughs> Actually, surprisingly, no. I have never accidentally clipped my uh, <laughs> clipped my fingers. I think about the fact that I could almost do that every time, but no, never done it. I've stabbed myself with the paper clips many, 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 many times, but I've never gotten myself with the cutters. I don't have any wood. Uh oh, oh, I got wood. All right. Uh, I was a wire artist with a very, very boring job about 16 years ago, and I didn't have my wire tools on me to pass the time, but I did have a box of paper clips. So I said, gee, I wonder what I can make out of those paper clips. And then I never looked back. <laughs> Just kept on going, one item after the next after the next. First item was a shopping cart. It does hurt to use the ring on the finger. The more you use it, the more it hurts you. Worst case scenario, you switch to the two-plier method, or you switch it to a different finger on your hand, but I'm used to it by now. All right, now that star's ready. Oh, the typical stuff. A lot of trees. Everybody makes a million trees. I hate trees now. I mean, every now and then you'll see a good-looking tree, but in general, I see tree videos and they drive me nuts because, like, it's like stick figures when you're trying to be a, a drawing artist. I mean, it's like the first thing you learn how to make is trees. Just giving trees away for the hell of it. <laughs> Hold on. A lot of trees. When I get bored. Or if I just have extra wire laying around for no apparent reason. I do not still have my shopping cart, unfortunately. That is a that's a very touchy subject. <laughs> when I was moving out of my apartment about six years ago, I had nobody to help me move because the person who was supposed to help me move bailed on me. And some random crackhead. I'm not saying that to insult him. I honestly believe that he was a crack addict. Uh, stopped on by and offered to help me load up the truck. And the only thing he wanted in return for helping me move was that shopping cart. And the man code dictates when a guy helps you move, you give him whatever the hell he wants. We are making an American flag. Uh, well, we did one star so far, and that took about 25 minutes. So it's about 25 minutes per star, and we are 31 stars in. So, yes, it takes a while. Da, 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 da. Oh, big ring. Bit of an awkward angle here. It's going to be a while. I probably got another eight hours on the stars. And then I got started on the stripes. Well, I got a little bit of work on the stripes, but not much.
The stars are a different pattern, though. Stars are king's mail. I mean, my, my stripes. That's the stripe pattern. But I'm not making any more of the stripes until I have the stars done because the size of the stars determines the size of the thickness of each stripe. I'm trying to figure out a way <coughs> to connect this helm's weave to the aura pattern was a colossal, colossal pain in the ass. But we got it. We got it. Did a little test zone, but we're good. Still gonna take a while to do that like that all the way around it though. Dun, 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 dun. But yes, combining more than one pattern to one another is always a pain. They're not designed to connect to other patterns, they're designed to connect to themselves. But where there's a will, there is a way. Self-taught correct. I was originally gonna do the entire thing in the aura. I even started and did a little red and white in that pattern, but then I realized that there is nine rows of stars and seven rows of stripes on the side of the stars, so that wouldn't work. <laughs> Damn math. Now, I got bored at work one day. We get that question a lot. <laughs> okay, hold on, let me get this. Oh. Get this in first. I really hate connecting these stars. Come here. Okay, one more little one there. Bit more unruly as it gets bigger. All right, now we're ready. Uh, this is just your standard European four and one for this one. This is Persian. This is Rondo. Stepping Stones, Japanese 12 and 2, more Persian, Steve, Helm's Weave, Larry, <laughs> good old Larry. Oh, Lordy. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is all paper clips. Yep. Oh, Lordy. All right, let me get this. Make sure the stars point the right way. Yoink. Be really bad to attach one of these stars to go in the wrong direction and not realize it until it's too late. And we're good. Now I just got about 45 more connections and this star is on. Definitely gonna need some more little ones. Never have enough rings.
Ooh, this is going to be a problem one. All right. Probably should have made this other connection first. But we're going to manage. will manage. Okay, two. Come on, three. Okay, let's bend this the other direction. Dun, 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 dun. I knew this was going to be a pain in the ass one. That's why it's very important that you do these in the right order. I did it out of order accidentally. I think I got it. And we're good. Back on track. All right. What's up, dog? What? I'm going to take you for a walk in just a minute. Oh, come here. Come here. You want to do your little appearance? You do your appearance. I'm going to take you for a walk just a minute. Finish this one little star. I'm going to finish the one star. I'm going to finish the one star. Arr. Gonna make that mistake again. We're gonna do the middle while we're in the middle.
American flag out of paper clips. Slowly but surely. But not for long, Karen. Gussie wants her walk. Yeah, yeah, I'm back. I only took a month off. Ever since I broke that streak where I was doing a live every single day for the first, like, what, 60 days, <laughs> 60 days a year, I missed that one day. The whole streak was ruined. Try to get back in the swing of things. Uh-oh, crew showdown. I don't have a crew. I love how every single one of the TikTok competitions is, Hey, join up and do this so you can get diamonds and we can get diamonds. <laughs> A shadow box. Well, at the moment, we're operating at about 25 to 30 minutes per star, and I've got 18 stars left after this. And then I still got the stripes. So a long time. Still working. Still working. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're talking at least another 20, 30 hours. This is a very slow project. The stripes will go a lot faster than the stars, but they're still going to take a while. Oh, we're all hanging on my wall. Nope, we don't sell. We give away and we keep for myself. It's a hobby, not a job. There's no way I could ever mass produce enough to make any kind of profit on it anyway. Not unless I find myself some rich benefactors willing to pay millions of dollars for a piece. Then I'd, I'd sell. If Elon Musk showed up and wanted to buy something, I'd sell to Elon. You're not seeing the splotchy, you're seeing the ends of the rings. Because I'm coating them as entirely as straight. And there's still a few that aren't great. Like this one here, it's like white on one side and blue on the other. So that one's going to have to go in the garbage. But then you also got that little tiny speck where each of the rings connects. I could get rid of that if I coated the rings instead of the paper clips, but that would take a lot, lot, lot longer. And we've already got enough time invested. 
I'm fine with a few off. I can always change them later. Go backwards and replace some of the slightly off kilter, but for an American flag, it just makes it look like it's used. It's been flying. That's why. I don't know where Sprinkles is. I know where Skittles is. Skittles is right here. You know, Skittles ain't going nowhere. Almost got this one. Well, I did the Ukrainian flag ring, but at the speed that this is going on, it's going to be a while before I can get to that. And yes, I gave the Ukrainian flag a ring away as well. All right, 18 more to go. It is break time and dog walk time. Uh, I did make a video of the Ukrainian ring before I gave it away. It was a whole live show. At least I'm, I think I did, didn't I? I don't know. <laughs> and I gotta go powder coat. Here, I'll start one. All right, 99 more. <laughs> Actually, 199 more, because I also got, I got white and blue. Hundred and ninety-eight. Hundred and ninety-seven. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go walk this dog to be continued. 